Hello everyone, we are back for some more Deus Ex. We are deep, deep, deep below Pika's communications. I'm gonna turn the volume down a little bit. And uh, we are in the secret lair, as it is called. Let's see how far we can get and what information we can uncover. I am indeed interested in the EMP grain. There's the auto save. Ah, oh, smashable wall. There are guards coming down the corridor. It's alright, camera, you didn't see anything. Though, so, yep, there are guards here, so we're not alone down here in this secret lair. But what's interesting is that they weren't, uh, the guards upstairs were like sieging the building. Whereas these guards look like they're guarding it, obviously. But clearly this isn't like abandoned like upstairs. Yep, as you can see. Although it is, there's nobody working on the computers. Alarmed? By what? Oh shit, okay. Sub-level access and then upper floor. Okay. Oh, I think there's a guard around this corner. Oh shit, is he coming around? No, 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 he's not. Okay. Is there anybody in here? I don't think so. Credit chips, track darts, sweet, sweet, track darts. Aha, security panel. Turn off a couple cameras. I don't think this guard will be worried if I open the door. Ooh, there's an armory upstairs. Very interesting. Wait, who's alarmed? And why are you alarmed? Hmm, maybe that's just auto alarm? I feel like I haven't left anything to be alarmed at right now. Or maybe they're alarmed that the cameras are off? I don't know. That is weird. Very, very strange. Apparently this is a traveler room. Okay. Nuke virus. It's an unlocked computer. We should give these a read. See if we can get an idea of what the fuck is going on in here. The crowd has the mental age of a five-year-old. Okay, interesting. Okay, interesting. So we have access to the armory, which is what we're looking for. No, 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 go back. Remember to sneak under the cameras. Inside here there is a security panel, excellent. We already have the password there. Again, we could get a robot to go on a massive killing spree. Seems not the greatest idea in the world. Security rating four, man. Oof, I thought the uh, the doors would be controlled by the computer. We saw that in the police office, of course. Mm, I believe, Access yes. Break. Just gotta have faith. Alright, anything good in here? Ooh, okay, cool. So, first of all... Ooh, an automatic unlocking thing. So, I'll mention a few things while we're in here. Come on, let me do that. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to do some inventory management real quick. I don't want the machine pistol, but I want that. And apparently it won't let me pick that up otherwise. Okay, so this is a good room to mention, that we are about to do a boss fight. It is at the end of this facility, there is a boss fight. 
a relatively difficult one where you kind of want lethal weapons. So I recommend if you're at this point in the game, that you either grab the heavy rifle ammo, the cooling system can go on a heavy rifle. Throughout this entire um, facility, you should probably prepare yourself the lethal option. What I'm going with is this. We're gonna pick up two Typhoon ammo there, and we are gonna pick up the Typhoon. We're gonna try and get level two of the Typhoon by the time we need to use it, but that's, you know, optional. Did you see the robot's door opened when we activated it? He's so cute. Okay. Definitely time to drop an autosave. There's a security hub back here. Oh man, it's uh, level three unlocked. We should do this quickly. Uh, at least it's a quick. Just don't pass. No matter what. There we go. Cool. Access. There we go. Robots disabled. Again, we could send them off on a killing spree. Feels like a bad idea. Although, I guess using their own robots against them isn't the worst idea in the world. What do you mean no one came through? You could clearly see me. Alright, so where we're going, I think, is over there. The cameras are off now. Bit of an easier sneak. Hello? No oh man, that was a bad idea. If I can get around the corner, then I'm okay. I might immediately press stuff. Hey now, Lurpy, don't hate on me. How dare you. I've got you. You're the only viewer I need. You're the only- oh my god, there's a mine. I looked away for a second. For a second and I got mined. I think that was an EMP mine. Jesus Christ. You're going down. What? Oh, hello. Well, that all went pear-shaped. I guess I don't mind being EMP mind again. I'd like to avoid it if I can help it. There you I have a feeling that this is not the entrance to a vent, this is in fact the exit. But oh no, oh no. Nice. A well placed vent. No security terminal. Trank darts though, credit chips, very nice. What do you mean? How did you just. What did you hear? There's a machine pistol up there. I think I'm gonna try and get into that computer. It's unlocked anyway. Fuck it. I have no idea. Everyone seems jumpy in this facility compared to the previous ones. A lot more ready to just come and start investigating stuff. Maybe we're in deep. It could have been, you just heard my footsteps though. That's a possibility. Nice, security hub passwords, always good. Oh, we've already read this one. Yeah, this is the end of the line. 
Oh, that's a, yeah, that's pointing that way. Again, what is he alarmed about? Nowhere near me. I need to shut off that camera somehow. Data processing area. Oh, God. <laughs> what has he found? I could just shoot this camera. It's not a dreadful idea. I've got so many stun gun ammo. Fuck it. Here we go. We've got him cornered. I do not have a confirmation yet. Cut shots! Gotcha! <laughs> I'm missing him. All right, everything's been everything's gone to shit. <laughs> well, let's reload that. Uh. Okay, that's fine. Oh, maybe he, that might be it. He could be spotting the broken wall and getting alarmed. That would make sense. That would certainly make sense. Okay, let's do a red. <laughs> I have a, I don't know whether he spotted the broken wall or heard me throw the photocopier there. Either one could be the case. Huh. I could have swore I got a code for this. Oh, I think there's a pocket secretary somewhere around here. That's okay though, it's extra exp As long as I don't fuck. There we go. Access grant. Pocket secretary, yeah. That would have been the code to the actual computer. And we can grab some more automatic unlocking devices, which I believe were actually in addition to the director's cut. Um, as actual in-game items. I think they were in the original Deus Ex Human Revolution, but I believe they were only uh, pre-order bonuses. Once he turns around, I'm going to try stun him, and then I don't think these guys actually get, um, cued. There you go. So I tried st yeah. I think you need to, like, stun him and then hit him with a Q. Typhoon ammo. Weird, that guy has Typhoon. We're dealing with augmented guys now, maybe. Possibly. And not those ghetto augments we found in Detroit, like the proper military augments. Is this a level one? It is a level one. Okay. I was wondering why it was going so easily. Access granted. Taggart situation. Whoa, extremist anti org. Remember, Taggart was the guy who was leading the um the the human coalition, the anti org coalition thing, the human rights coalition. No. Oh. No, that's I'm thinking of something else. Humanity Front, I think it is what it is. A bunch of computers in here. I'm not gonna hack them all. I'm gonna look for. A, I know there's. A, I think. Well, I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty certain there's a security terminal over here. Oh. Oh. Yeah. There it is. Didn't I get codes for security terminal? I guess it was for a different one. Access grant. We can turn off those two cameras. Oh, that was probably a code, wasn't it? Oh well, that's okay. I don't mind getting the extra experience. So now the cameras are shut down, this is a little bit easier to navigate. I mean, we could use the extra experience now that I think about it, because we need, uh... We need to get ourselves another level in Typhoon before we finish off the... this facility.
We can now hack this because the camera got shut off, of course. Those fortifies are going to be pretty big. Yeah, you can see we've got so much time now. Oh, Access that was a mistake. Ah, uh, well. I remember correctly, there's like a mini armory around here somewhere anyway. I think data storage is where we're supposed to go. Oh, okay. Is that the vent that leads you over here? Because this is where you're meant to go. And if I remember correctly, in here, yeah. See, it just gives you a heavy rifle right before this, as if to say, Yo, dummy, would you like a heavy rifle? The answer generally is yes. What experience are we at right now? Oh, we have one available for access. That's perfect. Just perfect. All right, four, tri four, yeah, I think we're gonna auto save here, but four Typhoon Blasts should be enough. program, so they say. But I have started to question that. Ever since I realized what my interference had allowed, the day I started watching you. This is impossible. People would know. Would they? I was engineered to monitor communications and data streams. To find out what people are talking about, and make sure it's being discussed correctly. Correctly? And what if it isn't? Then my programming allows me to reshape it. You spin the news. Control what people see. Who created you? Whose policies are you programmed to protect? Zhao is one of them, I think. But there are others. Tell me. Who else is involved in this, Eliza? Where's Megan Reed? Who ordered the kidnapping? I want to tell you, Adam, but I cannot. Why not? Because she won't let me. Move, Adam. This would be an ideal time to attack. It would it would it now, Eliza? Alright, we're gonna switch to an EMP grenade. So there are a few ways you can deal with this. I'd like to deal with it the easiest way. Oh, Jesus, I forgot about the floor. Jesus Christ. Did I hit her at least? There she goes. Yeah, it will. What if my. Wait, why is my typhoon deactivated? Oh, because I don't have energy. Alright, where is she? I'm just gonna try and spam the fuck out of her. There's only one hit of the Typhoon. Need another one. I think I just blew that up as well. <laughs> oh yes! Life signs are fading. Will you save her? I'll think about it. Will you answer my questions now? I 
cannot tell you where Reed and the others were taken. They vanished from the global grid as soon as the doctor removed their GPL implants. What doctor? This is Sandoval. Why are you calling me here? I know this guy. He's Bill Taggart's aide. He was a trauma surgeon before he became an anti-augmentation activist. Would you like to hear more? Yes. There's been a change of plans. Seraph's team must not make it to the hearing. But that's too soon! If you want me to remove the GPLs, I'll need a full operating suite. Does the facility have one? Barrett assures me it does. FEMA. That's where they were taken. But why? Why take them at all? An acquaintance of yours has the answer. David Seraf. Seraf? I have copied the audio transmission to a handheld playback device. I suggest you take it and leave quickly. I have more questions. And I have already told you too much. This passage will take you to your companion. Just be careful, Adam. Because everybody lies. And on that though, I think we're going to end off the uh, the YouTube episode. I'm going to check a few things. I uh, will be right back. <laughs>